Hi viewers, I am Avinash. Today I am going to discuss about unit digits. Look at the table carefully. Here we have to observe the unit digit of 2 first. Here 2 power 1 is 2, 2 square is 4, 2 cube is 8, 2 power 4 unit digit is 6, 2 power 5 unit digit is 2, 2 power 6 unit digit is 4. Look at here carefully. 2 power 1 is 2, 2 power 2 is 4, 2 cube is 8, 2 power 4 is unit digit is 6 it can be repeated like 2 power 5 2 power 6 is equal to 4 2 power 7 is equal to 8 again it can be repeated similar fashion for 3 also 3 power 1 is 3 3 square is 9 3 cube is 27 here 7 is the unit digit 3 power 4 unit digit is 1 3 power 5 unit digit is 3 it can be repeated 3 9 7 1 4 power 1 it becomes 4 4 square is 16 unit digit is 6 4 cube unit digit is 4, it can be repeated like 4, 6, 4, 6, 4, 6 and so on. Here 5 power 1, here 5, 5, 5 power 1 is 5, 5 square is 5, always for 5 unit digit always be 5, you can observe in the table. 6 unit digit always be 6, 6 power 1 is 6, 6 square is 36, unit digit is 6, 6, 6 cube is 216, unit digit is 6, similar fashion. Look at the 7th unit digit. 7 power 1 is 7, 7 square is 49, unit digit is 9, 7 cube, unit digit is 3, 7 power 4, unit digit is 1, 7 power 5, again unit digit is 7, that means 7 is repeated, it means 7, 9, 3, 1, again 7, 9, 3, 1, and so on, 7, unit digit is repeated. Look at 8 carefully, 8 power 1 is 8, 8 square is 64, unit digit is 4, 8 cube, unit digit is 2, 8 power 4, unit digit is 6, it can 8 power 5, 8 again repeated. That means 8 4 2 6, 8 4 2 6. Look at the 9th unit digit. 9 power 1 is 9. 9 square unit digit is 1. 9 cube unit digit is 9. It can be repeated. 9 1, 9 1, 9 1, and so on. For the help of this concept, we have to solve some of the problems. First of all, for the two digit concept, the sum is find the unit digit of 2 power 33 here solution we have to observe they ask about unit digit of 2 here the power is 33 that means we have not multiplied 2 into 2 into 2 into here power is 33 we can't multiply that much of time for this help of this table we have to do first of all step 1 is Divide the power by 4 always. That means 4 is divided with 33, 4 8s are 32, and remainder is 1. Here, taking the remainder, is remainder is replaced in the power. Step 2. Taking the remainder, it can be replaced in the power. That means 2 power 1. It becomes 2. Therefore, unit digit of 2 power 33 equal to 2. That's it. Taking the second problem, find the unit digit of 2 power 78. Similar fashion according to above problem. First of all, divide 78 by 4. That means 4 1s are 4, 38, 4 9s are 36. Remainder is 2. Taking the remainder in place of power. Power is 78. That means 2 power 2. 2 power 2 means 4. Therefore, 2 power 7, 8 unit digit is 4. Find the unit digit of 2 power 56. First of all, we have to do power divided with 4. That means 4 is divided with 56. Here, remainder is 0. In case, if remainder is 0, straight away, in place of power, we have to replace 4. That means 2 power 4. 
2 power 4 according to table is 6. Here in this type of problems, if remainder is 0 anywhere, always the answer should be 6. Now we have to do the problem based on three, uh, three, third one, third three unit digit. First one, find the unit digit of 3 power 78. For finding out of this problem, similar fashion for two, uh, two digit place, 78 should be divided with 4, always. That means 4, 1, 4. 4, 9, 36. Reminder is 2. Here the remainder is 2. In we in, in the power of exponent power, we have to replace 2. That means 3 power 2. According to table, 3 power 2 unit digit is 9. Second problem. Find the unit digit of 3 power 48 we have to do divide power with 4 48 divided with 4 reminder is 0 if reminder is 0 then in place of power we have to replace 4 3 power 4 according to table unit is it is 1 that means if remainder is 0 for any problem while dividing with 4, the answer always be 1. The next one is 4. Here, if 4 power is even, then answer is 6. If 4 power is odd, then answer is 4. Taking the example, find the unit digit of 4 power 16. Here 4 power 16, the unit digit of uh, uh, power is 6. That means even. If 4 power is even, the answer is 16, 6. So, it have a 4 power 16 is 6. Second one. Find the unit digit of 4 power 79. Here, the exponent power, the unit digit is 9. That means odd. If 4 power is odd, then answer is 4. Straight away, we have to write down the answer as 4. One is 5 unit digit. Here, for finding out of unit digit of 5, answer always be 5. Because according to table, the unit digit always be 5. It can't be changed in, at any position. Uh, taking the one example, find unit digit of 5 power 16 whatever be the exponent if power if unit digit base is 5 then answer should be 5 for finding out of unit digit of 6 take a sum find the unit digit of 6 power 98 here irrespective of the power the power the base is 6 the answer always be 6 because look at the table here the 6 unit plus always be 6 6 power 6 is 6 6 power 98 6 even 6 power 100 also be 6 so the answer always be 6 for unit digit of 6 next one finding out the unit digit of 7 for finding out the unit digit of 7 find the unit digit of 7 power 56 here the power is here the power always divided with 4 
the four is divided with fifty six or one is four. That means remainder is zero. In case if remainder is zero, in place of power we have to replace with four. That means according to table seven power four unit digit is one. That means answer one. If remainder is zero for any problem of seven unit digit of seven, then replace power with four. That means seven power four unit digit is one. That means always answer should be one. Taking the second problem. Find the unit digit of seven power sixty three. For finding out of this problem, the power is divided with four. Four ones are four. Four fives are twenty. Remainder is three. That means in place of power we have to replace remainder. Seven power three. Seven power three unit digit is three. Seven nine three one. That means unit digit is seven power three is three. Ready? Therefore, seven power sixty three unit digit equal to three. Next one is unit digit of eight. Find the unit digit of Eight power sixty-four. Here, the power always divide with four. Four divided with sixty-four, we get. Here, the remainder is zero. If remainder is zero, in place of power, we have to replace four always. That means eight power four according to table unit digit is six. That means six. If if remainder is zero for any case in place in unit digit of eight. It can be replaced with four. That means our answer always be six. Taking the second problem, find the unit digit of eight power eighteen. Here, eighteen is divided with four. That means four four just sixteen. Remainder is two. That means in remainder should be replaced in place of power. That means eight square. Eight square according to table the unit digit is four. Therefore, eight power eighteen unit digit equal to four. Next one is unit digit of nine. For finding out of unit digit of nine, if nine power is even, then answer will be. One. If nine power is odd, then answer will be nine. Taking example for better understanding, find the unit digit of nine power eighty one. Here nine power eighty one unit digit of power is Odd. If power is odd, then answer will be nine. Therefore, nine power eighty one unit digit becomes nine. Next one is find the unit digit of nine power sixty eight. Here, in the power unit digit is eight. That means even number. Nine power is even. Then answer will be one. That means nine power sixty eight. Is equal to one. Here, taking the problem, what is the unit digit of six thousand three hundred seventy-four power one seven nine three into six twenty-five whole power three seventeen into three forty-one whole power four ninety-one? Here, they ask about unit digit. Take the unit digit of four power one seven nine three. Here, the four power is odd. That means four power is odd means. Previously, I am discussing about the unit digit concepts. That means four power is odd. That means the answer should be six. Next one is six twenty five unit digit is five. Five power three hundred seventeen. Irrespective of the power, if base is five, the answer always be five. That means answer is five. Next one is oh, unit digit three forty one unit digit is one. That means one power four ninety one. One power irrespective of the power, the base is one. Answer always be one. 
simply multiply all of these 6 into 5 into 1 equal to 30 in 30 unit digit is 0 that means that means 637 power this whole concept answer becomes 0 next one what is the unit digit of 4137 whole power 754 here first of all the power 754 should be divided with 4 4 ones are 4 35 4 eights are 32 3 4 4 eights are 32 remainder is 2 here remainder is 2 this remainder can be replaced in place of power that means 4137 whole power 2 that means we take the unit digit only hence 7 power 2 7 power 2 according to unit digit concept 7 power 2 is 9 therefore 4137 whole power 754 becomes 9 Thank you friends for watching this video. Please like, comment and share with your friends.